What's up, YouTube? DMP the Gamer here, bringing you some Battlefield Hardline gameplay. Um, it may be a new series, but I doubt it because Battlefield 1 is dropping Tuesday, and I'm probably going to just be playing that all the rest of until Christmas whenever I get all my other games. But um, to get straight to things, I'm talking about the H car on Battlefield Hardline and the bar gun and battlefield one and somewhat in the old call of duties so to talk about the h car and battlefield hardline which is the gameplay that you are seeing now um it's it's very similar to the bar gun in in battlefield one to me because i, I saw some gameplay from uh, westy and if you want to go check out his video on his channel his name is Westy W E S T I E, and then his new video of the bar gun gameplay. He went to uh, Battlefield L A. Um, and he got to play the Battlefield One uh, free trial with a bunch of other YouTubers and um, Twitch streamers. Um, but like I said, the uh, H car is very similar to the bar gun to me because. It has. It looks like it's built just like the gun, like to me, and it has that high, uh, high recoil, and then it has a slow fire rate, and then um, I used similar sights as what I saw because whenever Westy was playing with it, I saw him use two variants, and the first one was the trench, which had the iron sights, and which I was use. I used the iron sights for a little while. I didn't get many kills with it because I don't like the iron sights on the H car, and I kind of didn't like them on the Battlefield 1 gameplay video that I saw, but I probably will still end up using it because I like using the iron sights on the LMGs and BF1. Um, then I saw the sights, I saw the, uh, the other variant, it was the telescopic variant, and it looked like it had an A cool sight, and, or some 4x zoom sight, and I used the the M point the M the M134 I think that's what's called on um, Battlefield Hardline. I used that site. It's like a 3.4 time zoom site, and it was very similar. And I was doing pretty decent here. Actually, you can see right there. Um, I used a per, I, I used it for a good uh, overall of the game, and I went 36 and 14. So I went on a good killing streak with it. Um, what else? Bar gun. Oh, back, back, back history of the bar gun. Uh, the main reason why they put the bar gun in the game is because in 1918 is whenever it was first issued to the U.S. military, and then it was used up until the early 1970s of the U.S. military, and pretty much then, uh, automatics were being introduced at the end of the war in World War One, and then that's the main reason why everyone's kind of giving BF1 some beef because they're just talking about how they have so many automatics in the game whenever there was mostly bolt action to semi-automatics which is not true though because there was always um, either some someone with the SMG in the trench or an LMG in the trench there was some and some type of people in the trench with a different type of gun and of all very varieties and then um, they uh, it wasn't always trench warfare which is everyone like tries to overlook and oversee because there was always wars in little towns and everything like that in the forest and in the mountains everything wasn't trench warfare and then everyone didn't have the same weapon in that tr in that um, in that setting of that war so people got to understand that you look up some history you know and then you understand why there's so many automatics in the game um but the bar gun was like i said used at the end of the war and then there's more uh weapons added that uh that i'm ready i'm, I'm kind of hyped to use um but like i said check out westy's uh channel on his um on, um, on YouTube and he has a bunch of Battlefield 1 information him and Jack Frags those are the two main people I would 
um, say to uh, go check out. But I think there's a few more clips of me using the H car here. Um, but so as always, DMP the gamer routes. Station.